Good evening, everyone. I'm Fletcher Mack alongside Sharif Aishak. We are here live at the Saints facility in Metairie. In just one minute, we're going to talk about the black and gold getting two key players back, possibly for this weekend's big game against the Lions. But we start with the other big news this week. Adrian Peterson. Yeah, Fletcher, he was traded to the Arizona Cardinals yesterday for a sixth round pick and he met with the media today and throughout his time with the Saints here, he was always asked, hey, you're 32 years old. Do you still have it? Guess what, Fletcher? Today he was asked one of the first questions. You're 32 years old. Do you still have it? I don't think it's that mentality. Like I said, I got it, but that's all you hear from the media and you know not not saying all oh, you young guys and, 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 and gents ladies <laughs> but you know oh he lost it if that and other so of course in my mind it's like okay I, I know that's not the case um, um but you know when i go out there i'm always putting my best foot forward you know and I, I feel like that it'll speak for itself i really appreciate the time with him you know um i felt like he was a great teammate um really loved his work ethic and you know, the time we were able to spend throughout the offseason and through training camp and even in the first few weeks, I know obviously it was frustrating for him not to be able to get the reps that I think he was accustomed to getting and I think what he had hoped for and planned for. But um, again, I think this is this is all for the better and allows us to move forward, allows him to move forward with, with another opportunity where it looks like he's going to get. One of the reasons it was easy for the Saints to part ways with Adrian Peterson, Mark Ingram is still in his prime, a key cog in the Saints offense, and rookie Alvin Kamara has been electric. Both of those guys spoke with Peterson after being traded to Arizona. All the experience he has, he was trying to funnel as much as he could into me, you know, just anything I needed to know, he was an open book, and I mean, I was thankful for that. I told him, I, I let him know that through a text. I'm always going to compete, never shy away from competition, never shy away from uh, anything, you know. So um, no matter who is here or wherever I'm at, I'm always going to compete. I'm going to fight and put my best foot forward. So, um, uh, you know, it just is what it is. He's still, I mean, he's a great player. He still has a lot of juice in the tank, man. He, he can go. While Adrian Peterson is gone, the Saints could get two guys back this week for the Lions game. That would be Willie Sneed, who was suspended for the first three games of the season, missed the game against the Dolphins because of an injury, and offensive tackle Teron Armstead, who was dealing with a shoulder injury. Just daily progression, uh, no setbacks. Um, just trying to see as much as I can do every day and uh, looking forward to Sunday. I want to play anyway. So pressure's been on me since my injury, since surgery. So I, I want to play. I think it's going to take some reps. Um, you know, I'm really confident, you know, with the game plan and, you know, how things are going right now. So it's just going to be reps, getting those reps before and after practice. And before you know it, once I get a couple game reps, I think I'll be back in a little bit things. And Las Vegas loves the Saints right now. They're currently favored by five points over the Lions. All right, for Sharif Aishak, I'm Fletcher Mackle. Back to you all in the studio.